than 40% from last year. And speaking of gas, wouldn't you just love it if you could save money on fuel for your car? Well, change is coming, and Penn State students say they are making it happen. Eric Parazio joins us live tonight from Center County with more on this. Eric? Well, Penn State just has received a 2009 Saturn View hybrid vehicle. They're participating in a engineering competition that will allow them to build a better, more fuel efficient vehicles. Now the students plan to modify the car and make it electric. Here's how. They plan to remove the engine, transmission and majority of the powertrain and replace it with a small diesel engine connected to an electric motor. The competition sponsored by GM and the Department of Energy. The whole idea? Give the students experience which they can bring to the auto industry. Some of these concepts may even be used in future vehicles. For us to revolutionize the auto industry, we need, we need projects like this. We need our students to have these hands-on experiences on applying new technologies to future transportation systems. It's such a, it's such a growing field, uh, just hybrid technologies. And, you know, with the, with the way gas has, you know, went, in, went up in price in the past few years, you, know, you, you notice a significant shift towards hybrid vehicles. Now the competition will last three years. The call to get the students thinking about better ways to build more fuel efficient vehicles. No word yet if these ideas or concepts will ever make it to the floor. We're live in Center County, Eric Pirazzo, WJAC TV News. It's time now for this week's blood call. The State College Donor Center on Pew Street will be open all 